Hey everybody, this is Barry Nori with Royal Caribbean 411 with your update today. Um, so about a day ago I received a letter from Royal Caribbean International and on this letter it said about your, your recent travels. Dear guests, it says, Royal Caribbean International has recently been informed that a person who sailed on the Symphony of the Seas on March 7th 2020 has tested positive for the COVID-19 because you are a passenger of the same voyage. It is possible that you were exposed to someone who was sick with COVID-19. Well, aboarding, uh, aboarding the ship, going aboard the ship, they took everyone's temperature. They asked us numerous numerous. Um, amounts of questions where we've been. So if someone was really sick, um, wouldn't you think they would have had temperature going on board this cruise? I don't really know. Um, I, I truly believe maybe it was a um, someone who worked on the cruise, one of the crew members. So I don't know what to. I don't know what this letter. I mean, I understand what they're saying that it was a passenger, but maybe it was really a crew member. I don't know. Okay. Um, or could it, maybe it was a passenger. Who knows? I mean, even if you didn't have temperature at that moment, maybe someone the next day got it. I don't know. Uh, so it says, stay at home for 14 days when you return from the Symphony of the Seas and practice social distancing. Take your temperature with a thermometer twice a day. Stay at home. Avoid contact with others. Do not go to work or school. Keep distancing from others or six feet. What to do if you get sick. And it's, you know, whatever, stay at home, call the doctor, and so on and so forth. So this is the letter that I got from Royal Caribbean International about the last cruise I was on. The health and safety of a guest crew remains the highest priorities. Thank you for understanding and cooperation. So this is not foolproof. Anyone could go on a cruise ship and get this corona and have coronavirus, and they can slip through the cracks and get on board with this coronavirus. Okay, apparently someone had it when I was on that cruise on the Symphony of the Seas on March 7th, and thank God I'm okay two weeks later, but apparently someone got affected and it was on the cruise, so apparently it's not 100% safe for someone that may be infected, that can infect everyone on. So I don't know what to think of this letter. I just want to show you this behind the scenes letter from Royal Caribbean International. I still love Royal Caribbean and I'm still a very faithful person and staying loyal to Royal. But now I'm a little bit scared uh, after receiving this letter and it just gets me to think what's going to happen in the future. I know you can't live your life in fear, but still, it was very upsetting to get this letter not more than two weeks later after I returned from this trip. This is Barry and Nori from Royal Caribbean 411. Thank you, and please subscribe if you like my post. Thank you, guys, and have a very, very safe stay home with your family and practice social distancing. Be well, and um, um, let's hope this goes away as fast as it came. Thank you.